David Burnham, a highly regarded investigative reporter for the New York Times whose groundbreaking work exposed police corruption and inspired the iconic film Serpico, died on Monday at the age of 91. Burnham passed away peacefully at his home in Manhattan, surrounded by his family, according to a statement from his longtime colleague and friend, author James Risen. During his tenure at the New York Times in the 1960s and 1970s, Burnham earned a reputation for his fearless journalism, focusing on uncovering corruption in New York City's police department. His most notable work detailed the widespread corruption that permeated the NYPD, which later served as the basis for the 1973 film Serpico, starring Al Pacino. The movie depicted the story of Frank Serpico, a whistleblowing NYPD officer, who risked his life to expose corruption within the force, a narrative that was heavily influenced by Burnham's investigations. Burnham's articles played a pivotal role in sparking reforms in the NYPD, eventually leading to the creation of the Knapp Commission in 1970, which investigated and exposed corrupt practices in the police department. Frank Serpico, whose real-life courage inspired the film, acknowledged Burnham's work as instrumental in bringing his story to light. David Burnham was a fearless journalist whose dedication to uncovering the truth changed, not just New York City, but also journalism itself, Serpico said in a statement. He helped expose corruption that no one else was willing to touch. Beyond his reporting on the police department, Burnham also delved into other significant topics, including government surveillance, corporate misconduct, and abuses of power within federal agencies. His 1983 book, The Rise of the Computer State, was an early warning about the dangers of increasing government surveillance and the potential misuse of technology, themes that remain relevant today. Burnham continued to champion investigative journalism throughout his career, even after leaving the New York Times. He co-founded the Transactional Records Access Clearinghouse, TRAC, at Syracuse University, an organization that promotes government transparency by analyzing federal data and making it accessible to the public. Colleagues and friends remember Burnham as a deeply curious and principled journalist, known for his meticulous attention to detail and unyielding commitment to the public good. David was a reporter's reporter. He believed in the power of journalism to change the world, said James Risen. He never backed down from a story, no matter how powerful the people he was challenging. Burnham's career spanned several decades, and he continued writing well into his later years. He received numerous accolades for his work, including the prestigious George Polk Award for his reporting on police corruption and various honors from journalism organizations for his contributions to investigative reporting. David Burnham is survived by his wife, two children, and four grandchildren. His legacy as a pioneer of investigative journalism will endure, leaving an indelible mark on the industry and the public's understanding of accountability in powerful institutions.